As the story goes, uh, during the shooting of this movie, you never broke character? As far as possible. Um, I mean, I chose a way of working when I, when I, I moved over to, to Dublin about three months before we started filming. And I chose a way of working. Of course, one never knows whether one chooses the right avenues. You just have to make a decision. And it seemed to me, in this case, that there was no other possibility of, of, uh, of working on that film. Um, I mean, not only because of what I needed to learn, but because of the obligation to a number of people that had given me a great deal of help. Primarily, I'm sure it was for more selfish reasons, but I did feel that it was that I could only learn what I needed to learn by working in a certain way. Yeah. As I sit here and talk to you, I, I'm just amazed at how good you were in that film because you're so different from the character you played. Um, I know your stepfather was paralyzed. Do you mm. mind if we talk about that? No, no, do. Was there some thought of him when you were performing? Well, it's interesting that you should mention him because. I thought about him a great deal before the film and a great deal after. When you're living with Christy, there's very little time for anybody else because it's like an assault. Yeah. You know, he's, he, <laughs> um, he's, a, he's, a, he's a kind of one-man band. Um, but to set the example of my stepfather against the life of Christy is interesting because my stepfather became paralyzed in the last years of his life after retirement. He'd been a very healthy man, a strong man. He was extremely shy, extremely modest, and um, had never really uh, totally unpushy. And the effect that this disability had upon him was to really force upon him the desire to be as convenient as possible. And he really, he's the absolute antithesis to Christie in that respect. He represents a whole area of the disabled community who are forced into a position of feeling that they are of no use to society anymore. And I'm convinced that one of the reasons that my stepfather died was because he decided that he didn't want to get any, in, in anyone's way yeah. anymore. So, so one of the things that, and I had great, great respect for him. Um, and, and, but at the same time, I, when I, began to learn about Christy, I just, I just wish that he'd been able to find some of that aggression that yeah. Christy had, because Christy survived on aggression. Yeah. He had to really fight it out. Yeah. I mean, that, was, uh, that, that scene that you showed, I mean, it's not, a, it's not a, um, an invention, that scene. He started a lot of fights in pubs. Not that that's an admirable thing in itself, right. but it is quite remarkable that, uh, that he managed to get himself barred from most of the pubs in his neighborhood. <laughs> Great job, man. Great job on all your work. And good luck Monday night. Daniel Day-Lewis will be right back.